Hey everyone, and welcome to the Ebb and Glow podcast. This is a new podcast for me, and I'm so excited that you're taking the time to listen in and check it out. This quick episode is to give you an intro into who I am and also why I created this podcast. And you'll also get a quick taste of what to expect from all the episodes of this podcast. So first of all, who am I? My name is Janelle Tremblett. I'm a 28-year-old living in Toronto, Canada. By day and sometimes night, I am a real estate agent. And the podcast is my labor of love of what I do outside of my role as a real estate agent. So if you ever know anything about real estate, it's very little extra time, but I definitely prioritize my podcast because I love bringing these episodes to you. A podcast for me is something that's kind of always been on my mind to create. For anyone who knows me, you know I'm a very chatty person. I'm the type of person that you can bring to a party and I probably have more friends by the time I've left. I love to meet people. I love to get to know people. I'm very curious. So you'll often find me asking a lot of questions to people and kind of just sitting back and listening. So a podcast where I interview people is definitely something that's in my element. And on the other side, I tend to give a lot of unsolicited advice. My friends who are listening will probably laugh because a lot of times that advice is not advice I take myself, but I mean, some of the best advice is not always the advice we take anyways. So there's definitely a part of me that has this like wise old soul. Even though I'm a very modern type of person, I feel like I have a wisdom way beyond my years. And I enjoy listening to other people's problems and troubles and ups and downs in life. Because anytime if I feel like I've been through something similar, I like to add any kind of advice or wisdom that I can to someone if it helps them in any way. You'll also hear some solo episodes from me where I don't interview any guests. I kind of just get here on the mic and just chat. I'll probably give you an update on my life, maybe any lessons that I've learned over the past couple of months, or I might just come on ranting about something. I, I would not put that past me. But It'll all be with a very organized message because there's one thing about me. I like to have a purpose in whatever I do. This podcast is not something that I'm doing without a lot of thought and organization behind it with a plan. As you can tell, probably from the branding and the types of episodes that I'm bringing, there is a full brand around it. And I hope you'll notice that within the podcast that. There is a lot of work that will go into this because this is not something that I'm just turning on the mic and putting it out there. There's a lot of editing behind the scenes. And the reason for that is I like to put my all into anything that I do. I do that with real estate. I do that with a podcast. I do that with pretty much everything in my life. So this is no different. I also want to give you a little insight into the title of the podcast, Ebb and Glow. A funny little tidbit about me is that I was almost named Ocean. So my dad and my mom were picking out my name. Obviously, my mom won with the name Janelle, but my dad's choice was Ocean. And there's a part of me deep down that I'm like, I think he was onto something. That's definitely really all about who I am because deep down, I am an ocean type of person. I feel the most calm around water. And living in Toronto, I don't get a lot of that. But anytime I go home to the East Coast, I love being around water, even better in water. And there's something about water that I just feel connected to. And it just makes my soul feel nourished, I guess you could say. So when I was picking out a name for this podcast, I knew I wanted to talk to people about their everyday ups and downs. Yes, we go through big traumatic things in our lives, but we also go through mini traumas throughout our daily lives. Whether it's an argument with a friend, whether it's a weird interaction with a coworker, whether it's hearing that we lost our job, like, you know, we go through the daily ups and downs that it might not be this big, big traumatic event such as cancer, a loss of a loved one, divorce, like, you know what I mean? But... That's not to say that the little troubles that we go through every day aren't as important. And it's especially important to talk about them and to build connection with one another and to share kind of what we're going through because ultimately that builds connection with one another. 
So as I was designing this podcast and thinking about kind of the angle that I want it to go, the idea of ocean, water, kind of ups and downs, the the waves of the ocean, the tides of the waves, you know, all of those things as I started to brainstorm, I remember hearing the phrase ebb and flow. And I always loved that phrase. Sometimes there's ups, sometimes there's downs, and it's impossible to understand how great the good times are if we don't have the bad. And I love how beautiful that is with the waves coming in and out. So with all that imagery in mind, I also saw the quote, the real glow up is internal. And when I read that, I was like, hmm, that really speaks to me. So I kept kind of coming up with names. I wanted something a little bit punny, but it still represented the brand. And after going back and forth for a while, I finally came up with the idea, ebb and glow. And the moment I said it, it just stuck. And there was no second guessing. I knew it felt right. So that's a little insight into what the brand and the podcast will be all about. And you'll probably get a sense of what's to come. Before I let you go and conclude this episode, I want to give you a little insight into the types of episodes that are coming and the types of guests that we'll be talking to. So I've interviewed guests so far from all across the world, anything from Australia California, Toronto, like you name it, I've been talking to a lot of people. And we'll be talking about things like I have one guest coming on that's been through a motorcycle accident and didn't think he would ever walk again. I have another guest who grew up in a very religious community and all of a sudden she's just like, I'm leaving this community. I have other guests that have been through big traumatic events like sexual abuse, divorce, cancer, like People go through stuff, and I don't think enough people talk about the things they're going through, and especially they don't talk about how they overcame them. We know they got through it, but it's hard not to think, how did you get through that? Where did you get that resiliency? Where did you become so strong? So this podcast is a way of sharing those stories and showing you exactly how they overcame everything they've been through with the ultimate goal to show you that We're all similar in so many ways, and if they can get through it, I know you can too. So I hope you enjoy everything I'm creating with this podcast. We will be doing weekly episodes, so stay tuned for those. Hit the follow button so you know when they're coming out, and go towards the episodes that catch your eye the most. Enjoy! 